Hi, welcome back to Missing Chemistry. This is Stoichiometry Grand Particles Lesson Number Three. How many molecules are there in 175 grams of CF4, or otherwise known as carbon tetrafluoride? Okay. Well, we're going to be doing this. We're going to go from my grams to my moles, my moles to my molecules. That's what we're planning to do. So let's go ahead and figure out the molar mass of CF4 first. We've got one carbon times 12.01, and we have four fluorines, and we have those each at 18.99. And these are both at grams per mole. So we're just going to write that down. Not really necessary to write it down, but you know, I'll kind of keep it nice. All right, so when we do the math there, this gives me a total of 87.97 grams per mole of CF4. All right, that's good. Nice. So now let's go ahead and do the math. All right. So let's see here. We've got 175 grams of CF4, and we want to turn that into one mole of CF4 over our molar mass of CF4. So far, easy, straight up. Okay, and then we want to convert this into molecules. So we're going to put one mole in the bottom again of CF4. This time we're going to use Avogadro's number right there. Because remember that number can be converted with grams, atoms, molecules, particles, ion pairs, whatever, right? A mole of anything is going to be 6.022 times 10 23rd of that item. So now we're going to do that. 6.022 times 10 to the 23rd. In this case, we're going for molecules. All right. So when we do the math, let's see here. This cancels, that cancels, this cancels, that cancels. And what are we going to get? We're going to get approximately 1.20. times 10 to the 24 molecules. Pretty snarly, huh? Well, that's it for this lesson. We'll see you back here at Moosine Chemistry.